Oh boy! Ladies, gentlemen, boys and girls, we are back down here at the Deer Club. We got a lot of projects going on. As you guys know, with the clubhouse, we have started a series. We have been busting ass down here trying to get the clubhouse ready for this deer season. Peter, bro, what you doing? Painting, buddy. Painting. Painting. What, what are these? These are trim boards. So trim we, boards? You tell them about the paint theme and everything. I, 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 I ain't got there yet. But we're getting some trim boards painted up. We've actually been doing a whole lot of uh, painting in the house. That's the stuff we are on right now, currently. But hopefully, we'll get a lot done in this video and you guys should enjoy all the content that comes out of this. But we got everything painted in the living room, the hallway, even the bedroom. And we did everything in this white. We did the ceilings white, we did the walls in white, everything is white. So to add some contrast, we're gonna be putting brown carpet in the bedrooms and living room. And so to create some more contrast to go with the brown carpet, we're doing brown trim, baby. Once this is all said and done, all the brown trim, around all the windows, the crowning, it's gonna look good. I think it's gonna look really good. But let's go ahead and step back outside. Now Peter's currently busting out the trim boards so while he does that I'm actually gonna get my spray gun and come back in the living room and try to fix some spots it was my first time ever using a spray gun so I kind of missed a few spots but you know it, it definitely can use a second coat even the ceiling could definitely use a second coat this is plywood so the more paint the better so I'm gonna throw you guys in time-lapse mode and get covered in some paint Just got all the walls finished with their second coat. Now it's time to move on to see if we can't patch up the ceiling. Do a little bit more paint on there. We had the guys roll it, so they rolled the paint on here, but uh, you literally had to. The spray gun was not enough. Now that there's some paint on there to get into all these cracks, now we gotta spray gun the rest of the ceiling. I only got a gallon of paint left, so when we run out, we run out. I think we're done with white paint. We're gonna move on to the trim, so uh, let's knock this out. Dad just stopped me. I put a thin layer on the entire ceiling. I think it looks a hell of a lot better. Just a super thin layer. I needed to save some paint to finish off that room, but uh, Dad called me out here. He said he wanted to show me something. I already came out here and looked, but you guys gotta check this out. Those paint guns are so sick, but look at what we're breathing. The AC unit is pulling the paint out of the air. That's pretty insane, dude. Pulling the paint out of the air, bro. Holy cow. Yeah, save that, put it back in the can. <laughs> Absolutely insane, but uh, we're done with paint. Peter, how is the trim going? It looks good. Everything everything I think is, is drawn yeah. right now, and we just got to lay them. I think that brown's going to match oh. so well. Hey, do you know where right. the sample carpet is that we bought? Let's see if we can great. find it. It's a great question. We bought a little dollar sample of the carpet we're going to put in this place. Let's see if we can find it. We've made a lot of trips to Lowe's, haven't we? Oh. Way too many. <laughs> Do you know we bought it? Yeah, we bought it. You're not in the bed? Yeah, that joke was gone. Yeah, buddy, I don't know where it went. But we went to Lowe's last night. We got a whole bunch of stuff, including ceiling fans, baby. We got all new ceiling fans for the entire house. We also picked up a microwave dog. The ceiling fans, the blades are going to match the trim, and then the trim's also going to match the carpet, and also the door handles, because we're going to put new door handles all around, and we're just going to have them painted brown as well. So, uh, the place is probably going to come out pretty sick. I wasn't going to put this much effort into it. I mean, I was going to paint everything, but now we're getting into, like, colors and paint and trim and stuff i wouldn't do it if i didn't know it was gonna look good but this is gonna look fire now dad's getting ready for the trim he's gonna be throwing up the trim and uh the dudes move so fast at everything he does i'm just gonna focus on trying to capture it on camera because uh he's gonna be doing it quick well that's gonna look good baby then we gotta paint everything else Whew, it's gonna be a job We're currently getting the trim up, and holy cow, does it look so good. Peter, buddy, this is gonna look fire. Just imagine the door frame's done in the same brown, all right? Oh my gosh, bro. That is gonna look so good. I can see it already. You got brown there, you're gonna have brown door frame, and brown down here along the floor. Brown carpet going into the bedroom, a brown carpet line, nice, beautiful hardwood floors. It's gonna be the juice, baby. Cut right back into the montage. I just couldn't help myself. I'm freaking ecstatic.
Peter just finished up the trim and it looks good. Peter, what do you think? It was 100% worth it. That looks so good. Now just wait till all these other trim pieces are painted in brown. The door trim, the bottom floor trim, bro. Oh my gosh, bro. It's gonna be so dope. Once we get all the painting done and clean up, I guess it's time for carpet. I mean, what else would there be? Carpet, fixing the hardwood floor for the hallway and kitchen, and then doing some bathroom remodeling. Yeah, guys, I'm getting excited. But uh, we're gonna go ahead, grab the paint brushes. We got that same brown right there. We're gonna do the rest of this room. See if we can't knock it out. boys and girls I'm so hurt I'm so hurt over this video now let me explain don't click off as you guys know we've been doing the deer club series and this video is everything on the inside I'm talking about paint trim remodeling the bathroom kitchen bunk beds office tables flooring I mean we did everything in this house everything has been touched and every bit of it was filmed until we lost the footage the hard drive just randomly crashed and we lost all the footage but don't be discouraged too much yet we have the very first day we came out here and did this project and the very last day and that is it three weeks worth of work is gone this was supposed to be one of those videos that really was gonna be my favorite YouTube video I ever posted and then it turned into not to this level it could have been because I'm telling you we came down here for three weeks straight I filmed everything so much and we lost it but that being said enjoy the video
video to say the least but we are finally done with the inside of the clubhouse i can't believe it it's been quite the project now like i said i wanted to get most of the stuff all done in one video and uh we got a lot done everything has been replaced the place is looking absolutely amazing and i'm so excited to show you guys and give you the first walk around of the finished clubhouse peter what do you think about the inside Dude, how do you think it came out it came out like better than what i thought <laughs> right let's get the reveal baby right, let's go <laughs> Now, as soon as you walk in, Peter, what's different, baby? What are your feet feeling right oh now? Oh my gosh, my feet feel wonderful. We got this laminate flooring in here and it looks so good. As you guys know, this is the original floor and we'll get into why that's still here in a second. But like I was saying, this floor, I actually got all this flooring for free. So we didn't have enough to do the kitchen, but if it's free, it's for me. A lot of the stuff in the house, we've been doing it on a budget. We got a lot of stuff for free. I think in total this project, the whole inside of the house probably cost me $3,000. I mean, money well spent. As you guys can tell, we got all the walls painted. We got all the trim up. These are just painted one by fours. Got some stuff on the walls. Picture board still here. That'll never go anywhere. Let's take a walk into my room. Now this is actually my old bedroom in here. Let's just like see if we can pull a clip from what it looked like before. Dude, this freaking... Here, hold that. Got a little bit of water damage. Shit. We're starting early, baby. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was pretty bad. Check it out. We got the bunk bed. So we got a big bed on the bottom, small bed on top. The whole room's painted, trim, yada, yada, yada. Got my office table because, you know, my home's only an hour away from here. And so the hour drive's not bad when it comes to, I got to have all my office stuff to be able to produce these videos. So I'll be able to set everything up down here and uh, be ready to rock. Got some storage over here. Just got a bunch of random junk right now. Over here, got our little closet all painted up. But yeah, that's basically it for this room. I think it came out so great. A lot of people were wondering why the window wasn't here, but uh, if there was ever a fire or a tree fell in this place, you just pull that latch and boom, you're out, baby. Little uh, escape door. But right across the hall, let's go over to the kitchen. Now, Peter, you sanded down the floors and you put some oil on them. Yeah, it, it took around probably three hours to do, but the floors are <laughs> nice and smooth. They look brand new, man. It's keeping the house old in there. Yeah. Still got these old floors in here, but they look a lot better. They're still drying, so let's not do too much walking in here. Of course, we got the refrigerator, the trash can, new paneling, trim work, all that good stuff. I hung some cabinets, got those up last night. The countertop, we just painted it. I want to do something different with the counter, and I want to get a new stove in here. Also, we missed some paint right there. We'll come back and do that. But the kitchen is basically complete. Now let's walk back down the hallway. Next door on the right is the bathroom. This bathroom was disgusting before. But check it out. Everything's nice and clean. We got some new vinyl flooring. We got the shower all painted up. Looking good. New paneling. Lights. I mean, everything. Looks so, so good. Let me just try to get one more wide shot of that. It is a small bathroom, but it came out wonderfully. Now it's time for my next two favorite rooms. The living room, baby. Oh! Oh my gosh, does it look so much better. Holy cow, dude. Got the smart TV, new fans in all the rooms. Yeah, even went ahead and put some of the deer back up. AC units are around the house. We got one in here, one in there, and one in my bedroom over there. Now we need some more decorations, but we went ahead through some of the deer back up. Got this uh, this bobcat over here. Check that dude out. Big old bobcat. A little crusty. <laughs> little crusty. <laughs> got some pictures on the wall. Another deer right here. Looking so good. Now let's go to the guest bedroom. We got four beds in here. Julius is dead asleep on that one. Hey, buddy, you're awake. What you think of the new house? No, I am. <laughs> uh, 
Sleep's good. Yeah. <laughs> so we got two beds on this side, two beds on this side. More storage, more decoration, more storage over here. Little nightstand, another AC unit to keep you cold. Hey, and there's a deer on the wall right there. Let me just pan around and give you all that full experience of the room. I absolutely love it. One of my favorite rooms by far. Dude, the wood floor, such an improvement. Oh, we also put in the new ceiling. We got the new ceiling up in here as well. We went ahead and carpeted the living room and all the bedrooms, even the bedroom down there. Basically, this whole house, everything has been either touched with paint or replaced other than the kitchen floor now the kitchen floor did get a lot of work done to it but uh it's still the original floor i guess the siding the siding in the guest room that did not get changed excuse me paneling but man this place has came a long ways and we have just done the inside we still got the outside to do the skin and shed we got the shooting range built if you guys have not already seen that i'll have it linked in the description i really hope everyone's been following along with this because man it has been a lot of work i mean just just look check this place out <laughs> This place was a dump when we started, and it looks so good. Again, we did all this. Go back, watch the original when we cleaned the house out. I'll have it linked in the description. And think about the before and after. With probably about $3,000 invested, it was mainly elbow grease and just a lot of time. This place was a lot of work, and I really hope you guys enjoyed this style of video. I probably could have daily vlogged this. We did so much, so many different days. But uh, I just wanted to pull it all in. I wanted a before and after like that. You sit down, grab your popcorn, and watch it. So uh, I hope everyone enjoyed it if you would hit the thumbs up button we still got a lot to do outside we'll probably be back tomorrow doing that but uh this was definitely the most time consuming thing we probably worked on this for like three weeks straight we put a lot of time into this and i hope you guys enjoyed it i'm sure it was super satisfying guys if you would hit the thumbs up like and subscribe and guess what we'll catch you on the next one